Treaty Oak Distilling Company was born in Austin, Texas. Uh, and we moved out to Dripping Springs, a town that's uh, just about 30 minutes southwest of Austin, Texas, about four years ago. This is our new permanent home. To start off, uh, the Treaty Oak is a real live oak tree in downtown Austin. It's about 500 to 600 years old, uh, and it's famous because Stephen F. Austin, uh, the namesake of, of our town Austin, uh, signed a treaty with the Native Americans underneath this tree in the early 1830s. The Council Oaks was a grove of live oak trees in downtown Austin. Uh, the Treaty Oak is the only remaining member of the Council Oaks, and that was a sacred spot for the Native Americans in that area. Daniel Barnes is our owner and founder. He started this company with his father-in-law back in 2006. He started this company making Treaty Oak Platinum Rum. We've expanded since then, uh, so we've got a couple of rums. We have made vodka in the past, uh, gins, and we're focusing on gins and whiskeys going forward. The Treaty Oak got poisoned in 1989. Uh, it was a really strange story. Uh, there was a guy that was in love with, with this girl. This girl did not love him back, this is true. And so he poisoned this tree, cursed and poisoned this tree with the idea that as this tree died, the girl was supposed to fall in love with him. Uh, spoiler alert, it didn't work. She didn't fall in love with him. Uh, but the tree was starting to die. There was about six months to a year where they thought the tree oak was gonna end up dying. Uh, eventually, Austin's horticulturist at the time, uh, called Ross Perot, uh, same Ross Perot that ran for president uh, up in uh, Dallas. He's a rich Dallas multimillionaire. And he wrote a blank check to the city of Austin. He said, whatever you guys need to do to save the Treaty Oak, uh, please go ahead and do it. I think he paid about a quarter million to a half million dollars was when all was said and done. Uh, and they were able to save the tree after about a year. Ghost Hill Bourbon Whiskey is our grain to glass bourbon whiskey. That's completely done in Texas. This is a Texas bourbon whiskey through and through. Uh, we take Texas grain, uh, we mash, ferment, and distill that. Uh, we age that in full size 53 gallon uh, new charred American white oak barrels uh, for about four years. There's a story behind it. There was a gentleman named Abe that actually died in a car wreck, I think about 100 years ago in a Model T or something, uh, right on Fitzhugh Road. Uh, so supposedly Abe still walks around here. Uh, there's lots of spirits out here, but we haven't seen any ghosts yet. I think most of the spirits are behind you. Huh? That's right. That's right. <laughs> I had to. I'm sorry. <laughs> bad joke, bad joke. Thank you. The key phrase for aging is the ambient temperature swings. Uh, when whiskey is hot, ethanol is hot, that will expand. It will push out into all the nooks and crannies of the wood of the barrel itself. When it's cold, it's gonna contract back towards the center, uh, pulling with it all of those barrel sugars uh, that naturally occur in that American white oak. Uh, so those ambient temperature swings as it goes from hot and cold, uh, day to night, uh, summer to winter, uh, that is what actually causes that whiskey to age. And here in Texas, we have a built-in advantage. Uh, I think it's 105 degrees right now outside. Uh, so that, that, uh, that gets a little bit more of a temperature boost than it would in Kentucky or Tennessee. As a result, spirits age slightly faster here in Texas than they would elsewhere. More than anything, we are trying to make authentic Texas spirits. We're trying to make uh, Texas gins with Texas botanicals. We're trying to make Texas bourbon whiskey uh, with Texas grains. So we're focusing on crafting spirits that are unique, uh, but also pay homage to uh, our, our history and the way that spirits have been made for hundreds of years. Ghost Hill Bourbon Whiskey is one of uh, less than 10 grain-to-glass Texas bourbon whiskeys that's on the market right now. Uh, there are not that many Texas bourbon whiskeys that are actually distilled in Texas, mashed in Texas, fermented in Texas, and we're very proud to have one of those. So Ghost Hill Bourbon Whiskey is an authentic Texas bourbon whiskey. So we're thrilled to be working with Rackhouse Whiskey Club, uh, bringing this product to states that it wouldn't normally get to.